Hello guys and welcome back again. So in here in this section, I almost forgot we are not gonna import our 3D model yet. Because we are going to set our camera first so we can use our numeric key to view the scene. Uh, I'm gonna show you that in a moment. So in here in our package suggestion, I installed a Babylon.js loader that we can use later. So this is the module that we can use for importing our 3D models. Okay, so into our game scene, I'm gonna create a yeah a box and a ground. I'm gonna create a ground in here. So to create a ground, simply say create ground. And this the ground. Sorry, this is a with a width of say fifty. And a height of 50. And of course, it will be inside our scene. We can remove this for now, or we can we can remove this, or let's see. Then we are going to create another one, and this will be not a round. This will be a camera container. So we are going to attach our camera in here. So if we control the camera container, the camera will also follow along because its parent is the camera container. So it's more like an egg and we put the camera inside an egg and we are going to control the egg whenever we want it to whenever we want it to put anywhere in the scene. So, okay, so for now we are just going to use the window, uh, key down and key press. So, you guys, so if e.key is equals to arrow up, maybe. Hmm. Key press. key so the key would be e dot key dot to lowercase and arrow down arrow up sorry so if we are pressing the numeric key arrow up We are saying locally translate new vector tree and let's say here. That direction is equals to so. We are moving the camera container to a camera vertical, oh sorry, camera horizontal. So this is the X and Y and Z axis and we, doesn't, we don't want it to move by upward or downward. And we are going to, in here, move it by its vertical axis. So. If you press the camera arrow up, then the camera vertical should be equals to 1. 
and if it's down camera vertical should be negative one left would be the on the left it's negative x so it's negative one so an arrow right should be a positive one and of course this should be a camera horizontal okay so let's try that for now save it and we are going to set target to new vector 3 0 0 0 or negative 1 I should say we are going to set the target to this position so the position would be on the center but more likely below below the ground and our camera container I'm gonna set its position to set a position of a mesh so you can say that X to specific position or you can just say new vector 3 and just declare the whole X Y Z in here so so declare the whole y and z and i'm just gonna move this above by 15. okay so let's check this inside looks like i forgot to run the server so we are more slightly above but we are still not let's check for the ground position you can also do that save it hmm let's put negative 10 all right so we are going to we are looking on our ground since uh, we put the camera container above so we are above and if we press our numeric key as you can see we are now moving by up oh yes that's because we forgot to if we key up then everything in here should be zero and we are not going to move anywhere Okay, so we are done with this section we have implemented our camera and it's moving okay so into our next section i'm gonna show you how we can put materials inside your 3d objects so let's proceed to our next section and i'm gonna see you there goodbye for now